guys! Uh, my name is Laura, if you don't know already. Welcome back to my channel. Happy May. Um, today is Friday, so happy Friday. Uh, my BoxyCharm just came in yesterday, and I already used some of these products, and they are amazing. I'm really excited about them. So I wanted to show you guys what came in my box and share with you some of these awesome products. Let's get into it. So this morning, actually, I used this Glam Glow um, Berry Mask, and it really smells like berries. I felt kind of like I was putting yogurt on my face. Um, it felt like that, and it says that you just tissue this off so that it can really moisturize your skin, but I washed it off with water. Um, but here it is. It really is very berry-like, and... It's by Glam Glow, which I like. It's from Hollywood, California. This is a probiotic, probiotic recovery mask, and it's called Berry Glow. You're supposed to leave it on for 10 minutes. Um, it says for best results, tissue off, um, but you can rinse off and pat dry, which I did. I felt like there was still, like, a, a, it felt a little slimy on my skin, so I felt like I had to wash it off. Um, but afterwards, my skin honestly felt so soft and it really is supposed to recover your skin um, it has lots of probiotics in it um, this alone costs $49 my BoxyCharm box only cost $25 so this alone was worth it um, it's regularly $49 and it says it's a creamy nutrient dense soothing mask with antioxidant rich berries and probiotics that instantly boost skin's health and restores radiance so, I'm telling you, this actually felt really great on my skin. Um, and the next thing that came in my box I actually used today is the Hank and Henry Black Liquid Eyeliner. And I really needed a new liquid eyeliner, so I was happy this came in. This is what the tip looks like. And I used it on my eyes, and it turned out really well, so I'm happy with it. And um, this is normally $17. It's in blackity black, <laughs> blackity black liner. Um, it says that it is vegan liquid formula and it dries um, into a satin matte finish. It's long wearing and transfer resistant. So it says it's good for people with hooded eyes because it does not transfer. Um, but yeah, so far I really like it. So that was Hank and Henry. And then the next thing I got, I actually have been using this too. I really loved this box, um, this May box. This is a high pigment lip gloss with coconut oil. Um, it's right here. So I was actually kind of hesitant because I normally don't wear lip glosses. I just feel like they're sticky and um, I, don't, I know I'm not, not that big of a fan of them, but this one really hydrated my lips and I honestly really liked this one. Um, it's, at first I thought, oh no, it looks dark. <laughs> Um, but it's really not. It doesn't go on that dark. It goes on very natural. Um, I, I think it's a really nice neutral color, so it will go good with a lot of the clothes I wear. Um, so yeah, this one, it goes for $17. It says it's a non-sticky, full coverage gloss, moisturizes the lips with jojoba seed oil, and provides a creamy full cover pearl finish that glides on smoothly. Um, and this is in the color Fifth Avenue. So it's Fifth Avenue. I actually really, like I said, I really liked this. The only downside is that after, when I ate lunch, it came off like super easily. So this doesn't stay on. Um, if you drink lots of water, you just are going to have to reapply it. I'll put some on right now to show you guys. So this is the brush. And it really glides on. It gives you that nice shine. I love this color. It is very natural, like I said. Very natural. And I think I'll be wearing this very often. Can't believe I actually like a lip gloss. Um, so, there you go. It's this. 
Joyer, I think it's called Joyer. Um, and then the next thing that came, I have two two more things that came in my box. This pretty vulgar eyeshadow primer. I always use an eyeshadow primer anyways. It just um, makes your eyeshadow last longer and it helps it not um, like powder off when you are putting it on, when you're applying it. It just helps it stick better to the eyelid. So I really am ha excited to try this. I normally use Urban Decay eye primer, eyeshadow primer, but I am going to start using this Pretty Vulgar. Um, and this goes for $22. It is the Uncaged Eyeshadow Primer. It says it's a blendable, lightweight skin smoothing formula that will enhance your eyeshadows by making them vibrant and long wearing. Uh, it is infused, it's infused with mineral rich clay to absorb excess oil. Um, so that's really cool. I think this will work really well. So there's that. And then the last thing that came in my box was this, I thought this was really interesting. It's by Tarte. It is the um, Micellular Magic. And it's very beautiful. It's in a very beautiful bottle. It's in that bottle because it is plants powered. So it says Tarte, Com Tarte Cosmetics, hashtag plants powered. So um, this is actually, it says it's um, makeup remover and cleanser. Um, so it says that you can use this as a no rinse water cleanser. Um, so just apply it to a cotton pad. And so I actually took this out to look at it and I thought the top was very interesting. Um, so here it is when you open it up. But that's what the top looks like. So you just put your cotton pad and push down on the top. And um, it says that this is really good to remove makeup, which is always great. Um, so I'm going to start doing that. So I'm really, I'm excited about this. It says, um, it's the ultimate lazy girl hack that it's gentle, no rinse facial cleanser. It removes waterproof and long wear makeup. Um, it also removes excess oil and impurities without stripping your skin's natural moisture. It's $18. Um, so I think this is a really cool thing. I can't wait to try it out. Um, but those were all my, of my products for this month. For this, that, this was the May BoxyCharm 2020. Uh, thank you guys so much for watching. I hope that you guys enjoyed seeing some of these products. And I will see you guys next time. Have a great day.